Hi guys! This is the Bold and the Beautiful review. So we got Steffi crying and then screaming, Ivy, Ivy, wake up, you need to breathe. <laughs> 911, I need help, help, help. Um, and then we have Eric conducting a meeting. And I'm just like, but Eric, what, what, you work here? You still work here? And I'm just, I can't understand what was the meeting about. And not only that, there's no, the CEO was not there. The president was not there. The vice president was not there. So what are you guys accomplishing right now? What are you guys doing? Nothing. Wasting people's time. There's like four people in there, and I'm just like, but why? What's the point of that? And if I was rich, I'd be upset that my dad is having meetings and I'm not present. Because I am in charge. You are no longer are. You no longer are in charge. So you need to let go of that. Okay? You can't participate in the meetings, but I need to be there. Like, where are the execs? Like, I'm... Okay. So, um, Eric was complimenting um, Quinn. And Thomas was like, no, 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 it's not all Quinn. Ivy, too. And Quinn was just like... And I was like, you know what? Ivy now got a, a friend who's uh, up there. I mean, Thomas is not really up there. I mean... But, um, yeah, Thomas is willing to defend Ivy. Uh-huh. So, um, th not Thomas, Eric and Carter got some texts, okay? They, they were like, we, they stood up, they went somewhere, they're like, oh, we need to answer. Okay, okay. And Quinn and Thomas had a conversation. They talked about, once again, Wyatt and Ivy, and... Quinn was just like, um, I just feel like, what, did you think about my proposal, and I really feel like White needs to be with Steffi, and, um, Thomas was like, I, I understand, I understand, and then Eric was just like, okay, we need to just finish up some things, and Pam was like, oh my gosh, Something happened to Ivy. <laughs> then we get to um, Liam and Wyatt. And that I, I was a bit surprised by that. Because I was like, Liam, why are you here? Why are you not with your woman? Why are you not with Steffi? She's in a dangerous place and you left her alone? You're such a gentleman. Really? Really. So, um, he went to talk to Wyatt. He was like, you know, people make mistakes. And Wyatt was like, so I need to forgive and forget. And I, I understand a little bit what Liam was saying because Liam is not perfect. He made tons of mistakes. Okay. And Wyatt, you did the same too. Okay. And everybody forgave you. I'm sorry, but... The fact that Liam is still talking to you and you pursue two of his women because you can't get your own, I'm, I'm just saying, you wouldn't have a brother right now, a relationship with your brother, if Liam was not able to forgive you. And you wouldn't, like, I mean, you forgave Liam for interfering in, into your, in your relationship with Hope, so I'm guessing... I mean, you need to forgive at some point, but it's it's, it's fresh. I mean, like, <laughs> let's give him time, okay? And that's what Liam told him. Give yourself some time. I, I, I feel like he's he has the right to be angry. He should be angry, okay? Like, um, and yes, he should let Ivy have it, but he should also see through Staffy, okay? Staffy ain't doing nothing for free, okay? Out of the greatness of her heart. 
yeah, I mean, maybe she does care a little bit about Wyatt, but her motives were not, oh my god, I need to tell Wyatt because he's my friend, he's been good to, to me, and I just, I need to tell him the truth. No. Okay, yeah, she wanted to tell him the truth because it was not okay, but she also was like, let me stick it to Ivy. Yeah, and wh while she was talking to Ivy, like, before, the before Ivy got... <laughs> Um, Steffi was telling her that, um, you're not Miss Innocent, okay? You j so, I I'm guessing there's this thing going on. Like, you've been perfect all along. People see you as the perfect girl, and it's my time to destroy that, okay? That image of you being perfection, and we're done with that. I, I want people to see your true colors, okay? And, um... Just why? Just keep your eyes open. Um, Wyatt gets uh, Quinn uh, calls Wyatt, and she's like, "You need to go to the hospital because your girl, whew, she got into an accident. There was an accident. There was an accident." So Wyatt and Liam rush uh, rush to the hospital. Steffi already there crying like, you need to say my cousin because that's my cousin. Breathe, Ivy. Breathe. <laughs> Sorry, guys. She really wants Ivy to not die on her because, <laughs> damn, that's going to be the second time somebody dies. And she's involved. <laughs> um, Thomas was just like, sis, tell me that you had nothing to do with that. Tell me what happened. Steph is like, are you accusing me? Are you accusing me? <laughs> are you accusing me? Tom is like, no, 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 of course not. I would not, no. Steph is like, I be fair. And I was like, bitch, you better not do it. Like, not again. Don't tell me that. No, don't do it. Okay? Ivy fell on her own. You better not say it. Okay? Because Ivy's going to wake up and she's not going to say, oh, I fell on my own. Oop. No, she's going to be like, bitch, you pushed me. Okay? So, um, Steffi was like, <laughs> she fell into the pedal right after I pushed her. So I was like, okay, you told the truth. Good job. I know it was hard. You know? Mm. And, um, Thomas' face was like, what? Again? But then, you know, Thomas, Steffi kept on explaining herself. She was like, you know, we were arguing and, um, she took my arm. She was upset because uh, Wyatt and her are breaking up and they broke up. And Thomas was like, they broke up? I was like, really? That's what you're interested in? Really? Boy, like really. And yeah, she took my arm and I pushed her. And she fell into the battle. And I was like, mm. Now, go tell that story to Liam. Liam is gonna be mad, okay? He's already mad because you got yourself involved in that situation. Woo! Mm -mm. So, um, why is there Liam to all the four of them, okay? The, the, Thomas... Steffi, Liam, White, they're all together. And they went in Ivy's room. So everybody's supporting Ivy. And Steffi can see that. The focus is on Ivy. And she's like, I am so screwed. Okay, I am so screwed. Um, th th it, it, there's some tension, okay, because Liam is looking at Thomas like, <sighs> okay. Wyatt is just close to Ivy and saying those beautiful things like you, babe, baby, the doctor said maybe you could, you were able to hear me and, and I was like, okay, 
That's so cute. I hope she wakes up, but she's gonna wake up, okay? Um, then Steffi leaves the room because she's like, I can't take this no more. She goes to see the, the doctor or nurse, I don't remember. And um, she's like, I need to, do you have my cousin's results? Because that's her cousin. She's family. They are family. Like, they love each other. Like, yeah. She, she cares about Ivy so much. It's not about herself being in trouble. You know, she just, hey, she's not thinking about herself right now. No, she's not. Uh, uh, uh. No, she's not. Um, <clears throat> so, um, the doctor's just like, no, we don't have anything yet, like, I, sorry, I have nothing to tell you, I, I know you're looking for something, like, you want hope in, but, uh, you need, sorry, I got to go. Liam, um, confronts, uh, not confronts her, but Liam sees her, and he's, like, hugging her, and he's like, Oh my gosh, I can't believe this happened. And um, just tell me what happened exactly. So Steffi tells him, says to him, like, well, she confronted me. Ivy confronted me. She was really upset because I interfered. And Liam was like, why did you do this? Like, I told you to stay away from from Wyatt. Stay away from Ivy. You just don't listen. And I need you to tell me that you have nothing to do with Ivy falling into that panel, right? You need to tell me that you did not do a thing, and I mean zero, not that, okay? And Steffi's face was like, <sighs> I'm like, oh, Lord. And seriously, Steffi, you need to trust nobody, not even your brother, because your brother is on Ivy's side. Okay? He's in love with the coco. <laughs> Sorry, I had to do that. Um, um, so, yeah, like, Thomas is, is going to be upset that Ivy is hurt. Liam is going to be upset. Because you got involved and you didn't have to. And I'm sorry, Steffi, you didn't have to. You just wanted to. Okay? Um, you were trying to find information. There's... The, I... The, the fact... <laughs> you were in the room, okay, with Wyatt and Liam. And Wyatt says, oh my gosh, Thomas and Ivy are in the office talking. And what you decide to do is leave them alone, leave the two brothers alone, and look for Thomas and Ivy. And then instead of knocking on the door or just saying hello, you're like, oh, let me listen to that conversation. Ooh, something happened. You really wanted to find something, and you found it, honey. And now you're in a mess, okay? When you get involved in people's shit, you end up smelling. <laughs> smelling like shit. Okay, um, so I'm, 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 <clears throat> and people are going to doubt Steffi. People are going to be like, well, if, that's the second time. And, like, maybe there, there's something going on here. Did you try to hurt Ali in purpose, on purpose? Like, um. And Ivy's version of the story, I mean, damn. I just, th th this thing's gonna, it, it, it's not good for you, Steffi. You need to watch out. And um, revenge doesn't bring you anything good. Yeah. Yeah, and I don't understand why she was near that place, why she was near the panel. You can't see the ch 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 what for? Because seriously, I'm just a chicken, okay? If somebody tells me don't go there because you just might get electrocuted, okay? You might just die, okay? Psh, psh, die! I'm just going to be like, let me exit the building, okay? I ain't staying here. Electrocuted. Uh-uh, I don't want to die like that. I'm staying away. 
And Ivy, Ivy, you can't see that Ivy didn't see nothing, okay? She just, just didn't care. Like, she heard the... She's just like, I, I don't care. What What was that? I don't care. Like, you did this to me. You trying to hurt me. I was like, woo, woo, woo. I hope we have a trial just for fun. Even though I, I feel like Steph is not going to go to prison, obviously. But I, it would be fun. Just like YNR. They have those court stuff going on. And it's really fun. So BNB, do it. Do it. Do it. Yeah. Okay. So that was my review, y'all. Rate, comment, and subscribe. Feel free to share the video. And uh, please like me on Facebook. If you love gossip. Hmm, you need to go on my Facebook page. Yes. Soiree on Rosé, guys. Bye.